In this tutorial, I will show you how to change chart background color. Right click. That's the first thing you are going to do. You will right click. Then you go to properties. All right, we are now in properties. What you need to do is you go to common. Under is common, check candlestick, select candlestick, then check chart shift. All right, if you have done that, just move on to show. Go to show, then you uncheck show grid. So as you uncheck it, you will look at your left and see the changes reflecting. Some people normally prefer this chart like this when it is looking as black as this, they like it that way, looking black without any Greek, they like it. But we are still continuing with the settings because that's not the one we want to, the, this is not what we want. So let's move on. Okay, let's go to colors. All right, this is the main place. I want us to do some work. Now, you look at this scheme here, then open this button, select color on white. As you select color on white, you are seeing the changes reflecting on the left. All right. Then come to bar up, bar up, select, select green. Okay, you can green here. This green, you select the green. All right, then for bar down, you select red. Okay, I hope you are seeing the changes reflecting on the left hand side. Okay, for blue candle, what you do is you select green again. For beer candle, select red. That is it. Now you are seeing how your chart looks on the left. There has been a noticeable difference. Now it's looking neater, cleaner. That is it. Now, if I click OK, you will see the changes now fully reflected on my chart. All right. So that is what I'm going to do now. I'll click OK. So you see my chart. This is how it looks. It looks more professional now than the way it was before. So there's one thing I want you to do. Any other time you open up a chart, maybe a chart like this. I'm looking at other charts that I have on my screen. So any other time you open up a chart like this, you just do the same thing. After that, you save it. I want to save it so that you don't have to pass through these hurdles of going through these changes all over again each time you log into your computer so i'm gonna save it so what i'm saying is if you don't want to always go through this hurdle in future hmm, the hurdles of you know repeating these settings all over again you have to save it as templates so to save it as templates you right click and go to templates here you see save templates you give it any name you want I want to name this template Euro. All right. So I will simply type the name Euro. Maybe Euro USD. So that is it. Euro USD. That's the name I give it. So I save my template. Okay. Instead, I should not put that slash that I added earlier. So I remove it. So zero. USD. So I save it. Okay. So that is it. If you want to see where your template is, you simply go to right click and then you go to templates. We got templates here. Then you can the one we just said now, you know, USD. Okay. So let's go to another chart. Maybe this, this chart here, this chart. That is on my screen now. What if if that is chart you want to trade and you want the the color, the background to look the way 
the other one we have set up is so what you need to right click you go to templates all right go to that template you know usd so you click on it and it will reflect instantly so that is it if you have found any value on this tutorial i want you to click the subscribe button to support this channel and make our youtube algorithm to move faster and improve thank you very much see you on the next video